Hey what's up guys this is the TechBoost channel and this is a video review of Cyanogen Mod 11 with Android 4.4 KitKat. So let's go to the settings down in about phone and Android version. Let's check out the easter egg as you can see the K and then Android 4.4.2 and now the other Android versions. So let's go back to home. And th this ROM include the Google Experience Launcher, which I really like. So Google now is just a swipe away, and you can uh, vo uh, do a voice search uh, directly from the home screen. The icons are really big and uh, nice. They let the apps to be more exposed and really nice overall. Uh, the font is the condensed uh, version of the font uh, is really elegant, and the overall performance is really cool. So other uh, KitKat apps that are updated are the dialer and as you can see here in this screen you can search for contacts let's search for test test and as you can see here I can find uh, my contacts and uh, uh, down below there are uh, the thumbnails for your most frequent and uh, favorite contacts which is convenient and if you tap here you're going to find your dialer other apps that are updated are hangouts which supports sms and i really like the sms support from hangouts uh, contacts have the new uh, hollow white theme and uh, i really like it another application is downloads and uh, the, the download application is uh, polished now you can sort them by name by date by size and you can change the view other uh, miscellaneous stuff are uh, the translucent mode and which is really nice especially in the home screen and the uh, the new color scheme which is using a neutral white color instead of the hollow glue color uh, enough for, uh, with KitKats, let's talk about Cyanogen Mode. So uh, Cyanogen Mode includes uh, some applications. The first one is Apollo and Apollo as you can see is a music player. It's one of the best music, uh, music uh, apps on Android and I really like it. Uh, so speaking of music, there is the SP Manager which is a, an application, a really useful application for uh, uh, music effects. It works really good. Uh, Cyanogen Mode have their own version of the uh, calculator, so it is themable. You can choose the hollow white or the hollow dark, and it has some features like graphing. As you can see here, I have written uh, previously a function, and here is its graph. Another application that Cyanogen Mode changed is the uh, camera application. Uh, so you can see it has the same interface as the stock one but it has m some added features like you can control ISO and uh, focus my favorite uh, feature is focus in video uh, other cyanogen mode features are deep in the settings so as you can see here there, th there is a interface and here you can customize the status bar for example the battery icon and uh, choose whether to show the battery status percent or not the quick settings panel you can customize it uh, add or remove tiles and other stuff and you can customize the notification drawer and you can choose expand the desktop with the removing the status bar other features are in buttons i really like those features you can customize the power menu and uh, customize the buttons and uh, my favorite is volume buttons customiz customizations so you can wake up the phone with the volume buttons uh, you can uh, control music and my favorite is keyboard cursor control and uh, this one is really useful other features are profiles which are uh, uh, programmed modes that you can access manually or uh, using an NFC tag which is really convenient and the Cyanogen mode account that works like a like Android device manager if you like this video please share it with your friends 
give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.